ICT concepts should work, but why then is there so many people who can't succeed using them? Well, it's because they either don't work or it's because they know the concepts, but doesn't know how to implement them into their trading. So in this video, I'll combine arguably the strongest ICT concept and strategy and show you how to implement them into your own trading to get the best possible results. Starting off with the strategy, we need to find three specific price movements within price as they can make our strategy. Now, the first price movement is the consolidation, and this is what starts the strategy. But what is it? Well, a consolidation is a price movement that moves sideways, which doesn't have a clear direction. And we mostly want to avoid trading consolidations because that's where it becomes difficult to predict price. Instead, you should trade within the two other price movements, which I will get into later in the video. But first, we have to see how a consolidation looks like. As we can see right here, we have a clear consolidation as price is trading back and forth within this range. And we can identify the range by there being a low and a high that forms a kind of square and price is just trading within the square back and forth. And most people compare a consolidation to a barcode. As we can see, a barcode is pretty much just back and forth within a dealing range. So that's basically how a consolidation looks like. Now this next movement is what triggers the algorithm to react, and it is the manipulation. Now the manipulation is a price leg where the market manipulates, so basically it tricks the breakout traders in going along, as breakout traders buy when the market takes out a high. And there's already stop loss orders above those highs, because some people are caught within the consolidation or trading the consolidation, waiting to be stopped out. So the market is essentially taking out all the orders of the market to fill its own orders, which I will get into later. But why is this manipulation leg so important to us? Well, it's important because we can take trades before the market starts to move. For example, when we see the market start to manipulate out of the consolidation, so moves out of the consolidation, it's going to move back into the consolidation, so then move even lower. And in this leg, that's where we execute. And I will get into how in a minute, but first we got to see this in the charts. If we look at this chart right here, we can see that price is consolidating. As we can see, that's the first movement. Then right after that, we can see price pretty much breaks out of this consolidation. And we can see price right after breaking out of that consolidation returns back into the consolidation again to move lower. And this manipulation leg is pretty much where we want to take the trade entry, as when price is making that fake move, both taking out stop losses right here, as we can see within these highs, and also taking out stop loss orders when it returns back into the consolidation, as there's someone longing in here, the breakout traders, and there's somebody already have their stop loss right here. So pretty much price is faking out all of these orders right here to fill its own orders to move the market lower. As we can see, price pretty much moved lower after manipulating that consolidation. So that's how a manipulation leg looks like. The last movement is the distribution. And this is pretty simple. It's basically where the market reacts to the manipulation and fills its own orders to move in the opposite direction of where price manipulated. And here we can also take a trend entry in the early distribution. So right before the market just starts to rally lower. And I will get into in just a minute how we can take these trade entries. But first, we just have to talk about this chart example right here. Now, the distribution is basically the market reacting from a significant level being reached, such as this right here. As we can see, we have a massive sell side liquidity down here. Price pretty much swept the sell side liquidity and it's now starting to move higher. And the leg moving higher or the expansion moving higher is basically the distribution. And within this distribution, we often see trade opportunities occur, such as this Favoli gap right here, as we can see in the mid occurrence of the distribution. And when price is distributing, we could expect it to reach a significant level, such as equal highs, as we can see right here, or maybe just reach a draw on liquidity. Now, when it comes to taking the trade entry, it is preferred to enter within the manipulation leg because there we could potentially see a inversion Favoli gap get created in the leg moving back inside the consolidation and then write down the distribution targeting opposing liquidity. 
Now, if we just take the previous example, we can pretty much see that we have all three stages. We first of all have the consolidation right here. Then after that consolidation, we have the manipulation breaking out of that consolidation and then moving straight back into the consolidation. And when the manipulation moves back into the consolidation, that's where the market starts to distribute lower. As we can see, price pretty much just rally lower after moving back into the consolidation and also reaching this low down here. So pretty much if we were to find a trade entry within this distribution or manipulation leg, we could look at this large inversion favel they get right here. As we can see, price pretty much closed beneath it, came right back up into that inversion favel gap. Then that inversion favel gap triggered price to move lower again. So to make this strategy less of a pattern, we can start using extra concepts and confirmations to this strategy, which could, for example, be equal highs, a drawn liquidity, or a delivery. But first, how do we use equal highs? Well, we can use equal highs when there's a high created in the consolidation and one outside the consolidation, offering more liquidity or just equal highs in the consolidation. That way we know the market is definitely going to move lower because all the orders were filled. As you can see right here for that example we just discussed, price pretty much created equal highs in the, that consolidation. And we can also see it reached highs all the way over here before moving lower. So we could expect all the orders to be taken out of the market. Now the drawn liquidity can add extra confirmation because if we have a drawn liquidity in the opposite direction, such as low resistance liquidity, equal highs, or just a significant high, then it adds more confirmation to price distributing in that direction. And that we could also see with this example. So right after price had reached up into the inversion Fibonacci gap, we can see we had a pretty significant high all the way down here and price reached that high and right after that, it starts to move higher again. So you could kind of consider this as a drawn liquidity. Last but not least, we have the delivery. And it is the one which is least likely to appear. But when it occurs, it is time to execute. As the delivery is one of the strongest confirmation within this strategy. And we find the delivery above the consolidation. So if the market both breaks out of the consolidation and reaches the Favaldi gap, then we get a solid confirmation. For example, let's just say that the market is pretty much just consolidating back and forth. Then suddenly the market manipulates and reaches a Favaldi gap. Then we could expect the market to move back into the consolidation and have a very strong distribution. And that's why we want to execute on the inversion Favaldi gap and ride that distribution all the way up to the draw on liquidity. Thank you so much for watching, but another crucial skill to have, especially when it comes to long-term games in your money-making progress, then investing is crucial, as it could potentially over a long period of time with the right research make you lots of money. So you can watch my video right here where I explain everything you need to know.